A pedestrian bridge that stretches across I-35 is scheduled to be torn down. Many people walk across the bridge to take breathtaking pictures of the Minneapolis skyline. WCCO's Red Chapman has more on what MnDOT has planned. It's a great view. The um, city's beautiful. You just can't walk across the 24th Street pedestrian bridge without stomping to take in the view. I come across about twice a week, and there's always somebody here taking pictures. For years, people would flock here to take pictures of the skyline and post them for the world to see. When I first got here, I walked across the bridge and took a couple pictures here. The view displays the beauty of the city, and for many, it's the first thing they see when they approach the city from the south. Oh, when it lights up at night, and then it shows the whole city. The days of enjoying this view are now numbered. The bridge will be torn down as part of the $239 million reconstruction project of I-35 from 43rd to I-94. The 24th Street Bridge is one of 11 bridges that span I-35 that will eventually be replaced. It's going to cut off people from the other side of, the, of 35. MnDOT says there should be no concerns about how people will get to the other side of the interstate. When the pedestrian bridge is torn down, the Franklin Avenue bridge should be complete, giving people access to the other side. The bridge will be reconstructed, and when it is, the chain link fence will go away. The bridge deck will expand from 9 to 14 feet. There will be access to 24th Street, and the bridge will be handicapped accessible. But it will be some time before this view will be seen from a pedestrian bridge. The new pedestrian bridge will be finished along with the rest of the I-35 project in 2021. Reg Chapman, WCCO, 4 News.